Hey everyone, it's your gamer friend PD, and we are back in Mars Warlogs. We are. Where are we? We're looking for. Oh, I guess we found the drug dealer. I guess we need to go back and find uh, that lady and tell her that her sons will not be getting drugs from this dude anymore. Um, here, let's talk to Temperance. Yes. Innocence. Gosh. Can you leave me alone? Come on, let's go. Uh, I'm, I'm not going to ditch my companion so quickly. Hmm, north neighborhood. Well, I'm not going to backtrack. I'm going to go around the other way. <coughs> let's go this way, just to see if we can get some more equipment or whatever. Oh, more guys, of course. Get that oh, I forgot to lock on. Combat is so dumb in this game. What? Why did you just do a, a critical hit? Oh, man. How many dudes are there with frickin guns, man. The end. Here, unlock. It locks onto people that are off your screen. That's so good. I like his club with the gears in it. Oh yeah, I forgot to search these guys. Um, search. Oh, look at all that crap we got. And let's just finish them off completely. Skip the cutscene. Search. Wow, look at all that stuff. I don't even know what to do with all this stuff anymore. I've got, I mean... At this point, I kind of feel like I have more... I mean, I've never used a health kit since, like, the first time I ever used one. Because they don't really heal that much. Alright, did I get all these guys? One, two, three. I thought there were five guys. I guess there were only four. Okay, let's see. Let's do a little sweep. Let's see if there's any junk piles anywhere. Just what we need. More scrap metal and more junk. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Thank you. Be ready. Join now. CD Bar, North Neighborhood, Tierville, and Sand. Okay. Let's just finish looking around to make sure there's no more loot to be looted. I think we're. this is where we came from. So I was supposed to look this way. I don't remember anymore. <laughs> Here, let's just look on the big map. Um, CD bar. No, we're trying to go the opposite direction. Back. Okay, this is CD bar. We want to go this way. I'm caught on the world. Okay. It's true. Okay, it's over to the right. right here. Right? This isn't the way it came, just to make sure. No, I'm going. I'm good. Oh yeah, no, it's the, totally the way I came. Good. Came from. Alright, here we are. And now we want to Oh wait, this is not the right way. Damn it. Alright, 
Alright, so it, we need to turn left. Ah, hmm, tricky. Finally, there's a step you're allowed to actually use. That's how you trick me, game. Amazing, those guys don't want to kill me. Hello. Hello, baby. There's a box we can open. Health injection pack. Yeah, so just turn left. A lot of crates to search. <coughs> I bet I can make a grenade or something. Oh, okay. Holy crap, there's a lot of guys. Oh, I leveled up. Oh, oh, I'm about to die. I'm about to die! I died. <coughs> Load last save game, I guess. Hopefully it's when I go through that wall. Yeah, okay. Good. Cross. Get that bastard for me! Okay, this is kind of bullshit. I guess I should be using my uh, superpowers right now. Come on. I can't stand that it lets me do a critical hit. But I'm actually missing. Shouldn't it cal calculate that it's a critical hit after it actually you've actually made contact with the enemy? Oh wow, did you kill someone? Oh no, you didn't. Ah, oh, innocents, wake up. Okay, okay. Let's see here. Deep impact. These are technomancy powers. Um, focused electric arc. Deals 50% more damage. Fluid regeneration. <coughs> Weapon surcharge. Hmm. That sounds like a good thing to have. Inflicts 10, ah, 10 damage to all attackers. Stable shield. Hmm. See, I don't think I'm using any of these powers at all. Um, let's look at the melee ones. Mm -hmm. Parry attacks. Guard break attacks. Hot shot, nail gun. Yeah, you, you never get enough bullets. Hmm. hmm. Let's. I'm thinking I should upgrade this because I'm probably gonna have to fight technomancers, and if I'm just using a freaking club, I'm gonna be murdered. Um, the attack launches faster. Power blow. All right, well, let's get one of these, and then this one sounds good. And 
and oh, I have two points remaining. Let's see here. Ten percent electrical damage to attacker. Alright, let's learn that one. And then we'll do fifty percent duration increase. And that's all. Let's see, let's go to our character. We have four points, so we can do expert handiwork. Let's see. Uncrafts, unlocks the best craftable items. Yeah, okay, yeah, sure. Okay, back. And now let's uh, look at our inventory. Worker's outfit. Wild dust. Oh wow, that's crazy looking. Um, physical damage reduction, health re regeneration, techno warrior. Yeah, I like that one. That looks pretty cool. We're, we're gonna upgrade for that. Yep. Okay. And then we're gonna do. Oh, I don't have enough leather for the rest of them. Damn it. Okay. And. Okay, so I need a bunch of leather. Um, I think I can recycle the stuff and I get a bunch of leather back, so let's do that. Okay, and now let's try to get this one. Let's see. Wild dust. Yeah, we can do that now. Upgrade. Wait a minute, I want I think I want it here back. Uh, let's look at his knees. I want to see what it looks like on his knees. Yeah, it's just these plates. It's not that exciting. Well, we'll do it anyway. Okay. And then the forearms are still composite. We don't have those yet. So let's look at his weapon now. Got an iron bar. Let's just see what kind of see what kind of upgrades we can do on it now. Handle. Capacitor. Fluid regeneration. Dust. Hmm. I think we're okay. Okay, he's healing, so we're gonna walk around and look for Oh wait, we did not finish searching these guys at all. I bet we're gonna get enough... Here, let's murder these guys forever. Finish him! somewhere, right? Or is that all of them? Did they all end up in the same place? You all died in the same place? One, two, three, four. I think there were... I swear there were more guys. Well, whatever. Ah, uh, here's one. See? Nice bone plate. Shoulder pad. Accessory. He looks so... looks like Mad Max now, or something. Or one of the enemies of Mad Max. Alright, let's see here. So we need to turn left, and we should find everyone. Back to sand. Yes, please. Maybe I'd better double check my map. Okay, where am I? Okay. So, 
back. Tranquility is right over here. Beware, brothers. Magical men full of anger are patrolling the neighborhood. Oh, a new quest. I have nothing to say. Oh, well, fuck you then. Big mouth. Oh, these guys. Oh, they look... Are these the magical men? Oh, they are geared up. Looks like he's wearing a suit of armor. I still haven't learned my... <laughs> I still haven't... Okay, I have to unlock and then go around this corner. Oh no, I'm switching to the wrong weapon. I don't have my super awesome weapon. Look, I have him in the stun lock. Okay, let's... Okay, there's another... Yes, equip. Yeah, we want that one with the gears on it. Okay, so we search him. And now we murder him forever. Search him. Alright, where's my quest giver? Tranquility. Okay, to the left. R, go to Tierville. What the hell? Oh, you know what? This is another quest. This is not the right place. Okay, let's turn around. R. Tranquility is not the person we're supposed to be looking for right now. We're supposed to do find frugality and this Requiem for Dreamers person. Oh wait, no. Oh my gosh. So weird. Oh, oh shit. What's wrong? This city's a fucking nightmare now. You can't go three feet without a patrol stopping you. There's a checkpoint up ahead. They're stopping everybody. And I would just get my papers stolen. There any way around the checkpoint? Not to where I'm going. There's always a way to get replacement papers, of course. But the guy who doesn't is kind of hard to find, you know? The authorities are on his ass big time. Why is everyone getting stopped? The war's over, so why check everyone? Well, I guess it's because of politics. I probably shouldn't say this to someone I don't know, <laughs> but the Technomancers didn't make too many friends when they took out the militia. Now there's a resistance. Guys against the authorities. That's why we got all these checkpoints. That and because it seems there's some guy in town who's on the run. I even heard that the Technomancers hired a bounty hunter to track him down. But, well, you know. Anyway. None of it's good for business. The guy who does the papers you were talking about. You said something about a guy who does papers. Wouldn't know where he hangs out, would you? I run a bar, so I hear things. But look, I'll tell you if you get ID for me too. Deal. Yeah, okay, I'll get some for you. So, where can I find him? Thanks, buddy. He's hiding out in the north neighborhood, where the gangs run the place. You be careful, it's pretty hot there. Bye. Later. <laughs> Later, dude. <coughs> You're silly. Oh, did I go the right way? Okay, so turn right. Bye, Desmond. Hey, it's Frugality. Thank you. I'd never be back in my workshop if it hadn't been for you. You saved my life, you know. Surely you'll return the favor. I went for a non-violent nice. approach. At least with them. They decided to leave the place on their own. <laughs> yeah, well, they didn't look real happy. They even threatened me. But at least they left. Guess I should think about getting some kind of weapon. I gotta be able to protect myself. Sounds like another quest. Might be a good idea, <clears throat> Yeah. The scumbags around here may not be hard to impress, but if you don't show a few teeth, you'll sleep outside again and they'll just walk all over you. Ah, you got that right. I'll go equip myself. 
What happened to this neighborhood? What's the deal with this place? How'd it become the hangout for all the addicts in Shadow Lair? Uh, not all of them, really. But if I told you this part of the city used to be really happy and lively, well, that'd be a happy and lively pile of crap. I've been living here for 40 years now, and it's only ever been a slum. THE slum, like everyone calls it. Even if none of the other parts of town are all that great either. Anyway, it still found a way to go downhill. People weren't real happy, that's for sure, but they at least didn't go getting all violent like that. They got sold a dream, and they were let down. Who sold them a dream? And, uh, who sold it to them? Oh, this camera. Oh, lots of folks. Same ones that promised everybody water, a place in the shade, or even just a job to make life easier. You know. The same one who promised them a future if they joined the army and told everybody one day we'll all go back to Earth. And of course there's those that try to get you to believe everything will be better as soon as you stick a needle in your arm. But those guys are smart. Half the time, what they say is true. One of them hangs out here, apparently. Don't ask me where, but the slums is turf. And seeing as the army doesn't come around that often, you just said the shanty much all the, the junkies are here. I thought you hated junkies. I thought you couldn't stand those addicts. Eh, sometimes I get carried away, say things I shouldn't. But you got my workshop back for me, and that's all I needed. I got nothing against those kids, to be honest. You can't really say they ever had it easy. Back in the day, we weren't exactly well off, but at least we had hope. Uh, why do you stay? I gotta admit, I don't really see why you stick around this dump. We moved here nearly 40 years ago, my wife and I. Wasn't the lap of luxury, but we couldn't really afford anything else. And there were things to do around This guy's supposed to be time. like 60 years old? She was an artist, you know? I just ran the store. Looks like he's 45. To Compared me. to what she could do with her hands, the Technomancers were nothing. She was a real magician. She's not here anymore. But I can't leave our workshop. We built it together. I'd have liked to know the place was going to survive both of us. If we'd had had a kid, that would have been what we wanted more than anything. Well, almost anything. I see. What do you know about Charity? Since you've been living here, you must have heard about Charity, I guess. Of course. Great woman. I don't even want to think what things would be like around here without her. I suppose so. It's not what you think. She's got good company, that's for sure, but that's not all she does. You know? Really? It may seem like an old-fashioned idea, but she's a good person. She helps people. And has enough influence so things run pretty much smoothly, even though the militia disappeared. It's sure not the source or its soldiers who are gonna do that for us. Hooker or not, it's people like her that we need, not them. <laughs> Maybe Wisdom and his guard dog should try selling their bodies to see what it's like. They could do with a change of perspective. I mean, don't go repeating that, of course. You tend to relax a bit when the cat's not around. No problem. I can't even think of how to fit it into a conversation. Ah, <sighs> whatever. Okay, so bye. Later. Later, dude. <clears throat> Let's just go... I, our timer went off like a minute ago, but I just want to... Okay, I guess that girl is gone. I thought I was supposed to get a reward from the mom, too. But I don't see it. So I guess we'll go ahead and end the episode. Um, thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you next Saturday with some more Mars Warlogs. Uh, I want to finish this game so I can start playing Skyrim. <laughs> see you later. PD out.